Welcome. Now, this is a subject that's kind of close to home to me. I just want to share it with you and see if you've got any thoughts on it at all. Now, if you go back a few years, if you can remember, there was lots of social media stars, wasn't there? Especially on YouTube. And they seemed to be making loads of money, didn't they? Or were they really earning that much money? But you don't see too many of them now, do you? And the ones on social media who actually are making a living at what they do on the YouTube or whatever are always begging for money now. Be noticed. They all have sort of Patreon or whatever and always asking, could you just give this much or if you subscribe, we'll give you, you know, that sort of thing. Now, I've never had a sponsor of any kind or made money on what I do. I have another job, and this is my spare time. I mean, I'd love to have a sponsor or make enough money to be able to just do this all the time. Let's get realistic, shall we? And I think quite a few people don't understand how many videos I've actually got on YouTube and all the other places. But I haven't made one red cent out of any of it. Of course, if there's any really good sponsor out there wants to sponsor me, hey, I'm all ears. But for these other people who are relying on, say, YouTube or whatever for their income, they're always asking or begging for money every video now. And I don't think I'd like to rely on my income from, say, a social media company or a tech company that could just slick its fingers and all of a sudden my content is gone and my income and I believe in reality that very few people can actually do something they enjoy say their hobby and make enough money to survive as well that's utopia and it only exists for the few and I went on to another site that was a MGTOW site you know, a free MGTOW site, but you could also pay money so you could put more stuff on or more frequently. And there's people there begging for money too as well now. Just subscribe and five dollars a month and so on. And what I think is that if I create some content I think is slightly entertaining, I'm not going to pay a site to put it on their site. That's kind of backward, isn't it? I mean, after all, it's just a hobby. But we all know YouTube is getting rid of creators. It doesn't really want them. And it's only going to get worse for them as time goes on. And unless they can find other sponsors, they're obviously going to go bye-byes. I may not have made any money on my videos at all, ever. But if they take my videos down at any time, I'll be disappointed but I will not be financially hurt in any way. And some of these people are a little bit silly to rely on their income from a company or a tech company that is obviously a bit fickle, shall we say. Oh, I remember the days way back when when you got a sponsor like, say, Coca-Cola or Pepsi, you know, those big guys. You can give me a call any time, you know. Well, of course, until they call, I'll try and make a few more videos. Although my big camera went kaput, as you know, I've got some other cameras I could try. I don't know, maybe I'm just too old to make any more. So what do you people out there think about these people who are making their living off of social media, say? I think they should have some kind of escape plan, don't you? And just to let anybody know out there that when I come to a video and they're asking for money almost straight away, I go somewhere else. Just to uh, let you know, and maybe other people do too. So you take it easy out there, and five dollars to my postbox 63 won't go amiss. Take it easy now. Bye. <laughs>